Hey everyone, Grant Alexander here. Today's video, I'm going to show you how I made this learning tower or kitchen helper for my son. Uh, it's been a great help in the kitchen, gets him out of the way, and uh, allows him a little bit of freedom to see what's going on. A lot of times he was acting a lot like this. And that made it really hard for my wife or me to do anything in the kitchen. So I made this. Uh, it gives him a little spot to stand on and he can see what's going on. I actually built this over the winter and filmed it all, but I had some problems getting the edit together. But uh, luckily I've got everything done now and I hope you enjoy the video. So this is a front step and uh, there's going to be a front piece on it like this and in order to get the secondary part of that step I'm going to clamp this over here and that way when I line up this one I'll know it's in the perfect spot. In order to make sure everything lines up perfectly, I've clamped a square in place. That way I can just set this down and clamp it here.
In order to hold this step up, I'm gonna use these fancy little T-nuts. Uh, they go in the back. Once you got a hole in there, you have to pound them into space, and then they basically add threads to any piece of wood you want, as long as you can reach it from the back. I hope you enjoyed that video where I made that learning tower or kitchen helper for my son. It was a real fun build and it's really helped out in the kitchen. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and I'd appreciate it if you could share it with a friend. If it's your first time here, I'd appreciate it if you consider subscribing and hit that bell notification so you get notified anytime I upload a new video. One thing I would like to mention is that you should make sure you tether it somehow to your cabinets. I'll show you what I did here. I just bought some child safety locks off Amazon and they got double-sided sticky tape and attached them to my cabinet. Uh, it made it a lot more sturdy and, uh, and it makes it so that you don't have to worry constantly about it toppling over. Until next time, cheers. Have a good day.